What's going on guys and welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. We are moving on after Johnny's little disappointing uh, movie theatre running. Uh, obviously, Rogue's got something on her mind and we are pushing on uh, and he wants to go and I think uh, meet Johnny by the North Orc or Orc sign. Um, so we're going to head there for the first thing for today. But also River wants to head over. He wants a meal or something. He wants to uh, have beers, which he promised us through the missions. Then we've also got to go and do the uh, Embers mission, which is the main story, which we've been holding off. Because uh, obviously I know kind of works through some of these. But hopefully you're having a good morning, afternoon or evening. Uh, and uh, yeah, we are still doing the marathon stream, of course. Uh, we're still pushing up, uh, and I'm recording all these live, hence the reason you can see chat just below the camera. So, we're gonna go and meet Johnny by North Orc and pursue more of this story arc, uh, and we'll see what he wants to do up there. Alright, so he's just... Yeah, I'm just gonna pull in here. I'll just pull in here. What is this place? Is this a theme park or something? Do you hate your meat? <laughs> this city is beautiful. This ought to work. Well, so why are we here exactly? Heard Carry got himself a buck of mansion here. Done well. Where do you hear anything about Kerry? In and about town. Scream sheets are full of shit about him. Oh, right. You weren't around. Mm-hmm. Your big night out. So what? Want to pay him a visit? Yep. Seems as good a time as any. So I gotta hit Kerry's digs, look around, critique the drapes? Know what they're writing about him? He's depressed. Attempted suicide. What, really worried he wants to hurt himself? Who knows? Either way, could give him some pointers. Meaning you want to go in person. Gotta hand you the reins again. Yes. Behaved myself last time, didn't I? I think I warrant another furlough for good behavior. Why, do I, why don't I remember Kerry? <laughs> uh-huh. First rogue, now carry. Who's next on the list of conjugal visits? Nobody. Just so happens the list of people I consider friends and who are still alive is pretty damn short. Exactly why I need to talk to Carrie. What was that about attempted suicide? Amateur hour. Didn't even cobble together the right audience. Carrie's the guy Johnny Cobb will see in the memory. Skull in his room. Bodyguard took his gun like candy from a baby. Could just be the rumor mill. Sure, could. But I want to know. Okay, but I want to know what you plan to do. Nothing stupid, I promise. Just want to see how he's doing. How you plan to tell him it's you? Could be dealing with some real personal shit right now. Might not be the best time to mess with his head. V Care was always dealing with personal shit. That's why, in spite of everything else, we got along. Don't worry. I'll play it by ear, sensitively. First things first. We gotta get into that house. I know what you mean. Okay. Just let me know when you want to take the wheel. He was the guy that was at the dressing room door when who said started talking and giving him shit and stuff. When he was going into the room with. Uh, What's she called? Yeah, that's him, right? Him with the glasses, short hair. White guy. Yeah. Alright, cool. Alright, let's head up there and find out what is going on and see what Johnny is going to do. So I'm guessing this whole story arc is more just... Johnny... More, more about Johnny and stuff. This whole story arc regarding Rogue and that. Which makes sense, because it's his past, right? But the question is... Is how, how old is... Uh, how old is... Um, Kerry? 
But before I go anywhere or head up there, I do want to sell some things here because there is a... Whoa. Damn. Evening. How are we doing? I am just getting rid of a couple of things that I do not need anymore. Na 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 na. That's Johnny's gun, isn't it? Wait, Malorian. Wait, is that? It's not, is it? Oh, it's a smart pistol. A little less damage. That submachine gun looks fast. Power submachine gun. Damage is low, of course. Oh yeah, that's his pistol. Okay. Sniper rifle. That's a tech sniper rifle. Clearly better, tier three. Increases reload speed, comes with a custom silencer though. I do like the silencer kind of thing with it. Just pop people off from a distance. The bloody tattoo. Johnny and V, of course. Uh, have we got some, uh, we do have. We can finally get cool to 20. Only affects Thobos. Guaranteed crit hits with Thobo weapons when crouch, sprinting, sliding, dodging or dashing. No movement speed penalty when aiming a Thobo weapon. Speed! So we need this to unlock this. So we need to get crouch. Sneaky sneakies. Let's get back in the car. Does he got a samurai on the bloody thing? Or oh, like this. Fugly as seafood barf. Hope it was expensive at least. Damn. Something's gotta justify this level of tacky. Guess if I had a fave, it'd be that one. What's old single we put out? No idea why Carrie hoards shit like that. Okay, <laughs> even I know that one. An oldie but a goodie. What's second conflict? Carrie'd always go straight for kitsch with titles. Guess nothing's changed. Hmm. The thing is, is he gonna be even be in here? Looks like he's showering. Alone, too. Good thing, believe me. Okay, leave the rest to me. I'll get him out of there. Here we go again. Drop one of Misty's special pills. Let's go. Okay. Relic mount ball function. Whoa. Ah, oh, feels so much better. Now let's see which are up for show and which are actually strummable. We lost everything. <laughs> Keep playing. All right. Johnny? Carrie? No. <laughs> no. That is some fucking joke. Hang on. What did Silverhand tell me before he died? I told you to stop being a pussy. Did you? Huh? Johnny fucking Silverhand. Fuck. 
I mean, how? Surprise. Motherfucker! <laughs> Saw that coming. Okay. Weren't expecting me. I get it. Oh, fucking contraire. Been waiting 50 years to do that. She had changed a bit. Sporting a new style, trying to stay hip. Yeah, kinda. What about you? Shit. Johnny. Oh, man. I need a drink. All right. Come on. Tell me. Why do you look like a small time klepto punk from the afterlife? This is V. You'd like him. The fuck, Johnny? <laughs> Doesn't explain a thing. Nice place. Ain't seen much of it yet. Moved in after the fourth album came out. All sold well, apparently. Fuck you, Johnny. Don't even start. Who'd you sign with? Shit. With Arasaka. Mornings, I record at their studio. Then evenings, Yori pops over for a little neighborly cookout. Hmm. And who'd you really sign with? MSM Records. Another pillar of society. Come on. Sit down with me. Tell me where you've been all this time. Steal yourself for a long story. I just really want it to be tragic. Sad as all fuck over all those years. I'm sat a bit on an angle. Because if I hear you spent them with the nomads. Do you mind causing your load, legs? Open winning your hair. <laughs> or cool and relaxed in orbit. And now you've just popped by to shit all over my life. Well, I'm going to lose my damn mind. Listen. Judge for yourself. Yeah, that looks a bit weird, doesn't it? Oh, fuck. Remember? The one damn time Henry showed up sober and clean as a whistle. Uh-huh. And played absolute tripe. At least Danny was happy. Looking at him now, those really were the best of times. Playing fucking rat-infested dumps. Argued before every gig. Had no idea what we wanted to play and never had an ed to our name. Nancy, control freak. Henry smelled like zappers and piss. I was always stealing your pants. Hella good times, man. Never did get what Denny saw in that guy. I mean, smart in that one. Maybe too smart for the company she kept. Nah, Denny always went for losers and capable of dressing themselves. Oh, Hank was perfect. Half a brain and high all the time. She got to rescue him over and over again. Why'd she never try and fix me? Would have had to get in line, that's why. Who's that? Luis, the ex-wife. The what? Huh, <laughs> you're kidding. How long did it last? Eh, hey, too long. But don't worry. It worked out well. For her. Gave her my house in Tokyo. Cars. Kids. Yeah. Worked out pretty well for you too, then. I think crazy you can see the veins in his legs. Stuff about you being depressed. It's true. Nope. Promo stratagem. Suicide attempts too. Think putting a bullet through your skull will help your sales? Didn't work for you. Nobody remembers Samurai. Now you're just butthurt because I managed fine without you. Fuck me, got no answer to that. Still in touch with the gang. Just Nance. Changed her name to Bess Isis. <laughs> Works for N54 News. Could track down Denny and Henry if you want. Maybe get together, you know, jam or something. Bess Isis, damn, Nance really went for it. Though all I hear is part-time stripper with a thing for ancient Egypt. Shame you died. Sure she would have welcomed your input. 
How is she in general, besides having nothing to do with music? Could ask her yourself. Henry probably killed his own liver. That nah, would've hurt if he was gone. Got mutual friends. Few calls and I should be able to track him down. Denny might still be in the biz. Actually had talent. And the spine. Yeah, released something not too long ago. Moved to North Oak, too. You just so, said you weren't in touch. Didn't hear it from her. I think she might be avoiding me. You ever leave this house? I wonder if they actually are gonna get nope. together. You wanna bring Samurai back? One last gig. No. Could do one gig. Play some dive where nobody plays us. I mean, got my reputation to think about. But I won't have to explain what happened. All this. Nah, we'll spare him. Hella boring story. Biochips, Arasaka's evil schemes, magic pills. <laughs> we'll just say you're my new input. All right, let's do it. Fuck yeah! Okay! Send you Nancy's number in a sec. I'll go after Henry and Denny. Hmm, I'm not there. Figure it out with V. Sure, uh, you two get along? Not lately, no. We don't have much of a choice, though. Oh, oh my. I guess we're doing a show. Time for Johnny to rock it back out again. Johnny, you okay? Maybe. No. Ah, so you must be V. Johnny mentioned something like this might happen. You two have fun, at least? <laughs> that a hint of disapproval, I hear? Just sit tight for a bit. Rest. Don't worry about a thing. The hell is this concert thing? Did you hear that? Get sharper as the pills wear off. So? Want to see Samurai live? Probably won't get another chance. What if this ends up like the rogue thing? One big letdown. Nah, this is different. Carrie needs this concert. Okay, call on Nancy. Fuck yeah, nice. Nancy Hartley. Uh, Nancy? Uh, I mean, uh, Bess? Bess Isis? No, this is her underpaid underappreciated assistant steven n54 news how can i help <laughs> want to talk to bess she's not here calling from carrie uridine's residence cool but bess still isn't here she was supposed to be back two days ago uh -oh. went to the totentons to shoot some stuff story on maelstrom call back next week or just watch the news if anything happens to her, I'll be the first to cover it. Bet you will do. feeling, V. Think we better head to the Taunton tent. All right. I'll give him that one. The mod car. That looks weird as hell. Oh, there's my car. Well, why just randomly just pops in anyway? So we've got to head to Totten Tans, 2.3 kilometers away. Okay, so now let's enter Totten Tans and find out what's going on. Fuck all, starting to come together. With this. No media would ever go for the Totten Tans, except Nancy. What is the Totten Tons? I'm so sorry. Is this a drug den or something? Hey, Baggins, good morning. 
Oh god, it's these guys. Like your style. Minimalist. You to have chrome just like that. Total Start moving. Two. Fuck yeah. Third floor. And press the button. Oh, my fingers are numb. Oh boy. I feel like my blades might be coming out for this one. Hear that? Tinnitus today. Alright, guys. This one I like. Later. Can see Go you later. On. You'll blend in, no problem. Is this a club? Can find a way to handle anyone. We survive. Fuck. No fucking way. Remember that tape from All Foods? That's the Jumu did Royce. No, 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 no. Wouldn't be that stupid to show up here. You the one? Yeah? What? Anyone actually boo-hoo when he went? Oh, look at this. A chance at a nick in the barrel. Get the fuck out! Now! That's the All Foods, punk. I'm not blind! What do you want? Watch out for that one. You the one in charge now? Yeah! Puzzled? Never heard of you is all. You'll get your chance! Best Isis. Mean anything to you? You work with her? No, just gotta talk. Heard she's here. Gotta talk? Sure. I'll take you. Too easy this is going. This could end up turning into some like John Wick fighting to be honest, scene. Should be thanking you. For what? Getting Royce out of the way. It was about time. Worked out pretty well for me, too. No problem. Anytime. So she took over Royce. And as you know, we killed Royce back when we took the flathead. Very early on in the playthrough. Get this, uh-uh. Must have spent too much time with paranoid Patty in there. It's about samurai. Talk later, okay? Right. Time to fight myself the way through this club. Follow me, I'll get us out of here. Elevator, over there. Let's go. Oh, 
Damn it, missed him. Oh, I missed her, I should say. Where's the music gone? Give me them beats. Slow and the cars outside. Let's go. Hey, Harry. Hello. You all right? I've had better days. That gonquette was sure I was a goddamn spy. Thing is, you look now more your age, but still looking young for what, about 80? Okay, come on. Fuck. Just hope the car's still where I parked it. Why'd you come here? Really? Wanted to do a story on the music at the Totentans. <laughs> no wonder Patricia didn't buy your story. That was easy. Oh god, what is this car? Oh, for fuck's sake! Could have been worse. <laughs> this way you got a souvenir. Fuck souvenirs. I'm headed straight back to the editing room. Wanna talk? Gotta come with me. Conquer like this. Hope it gets us there in one piece. All right. So what's Carrie want? Wants to bring back samurai. One gig, one night. There is no samurai without Silverhand. I'll play for Johnny. <laughs> you. Yep. Let's just say Silverhand was more visionary than musician. I got this. Trust me. Well, if you got Carrie on board, what's in it for me? I believe I just saved your ass. Too bad you couldn't wait until after I'd gotten some footage. Ugh, Patricia, paranoid cuntbag. Wish I'd stop by when that other guy Maybe was war in charge. Zone. Royce. No, you really don't. Believe me. Let's skip that ride. Where the hell are you going? We're oh. here. Hop out. All right. So, the concert? <sighs> Tell Carrie I'll put it together. Be in touch. Okay. Thanks. Sweet. Went pretty damn well. Now call Carrie. Hey, so how'd it go? Talk to Nance? Yep, she agreed. Even said she'd organize the gig. Still a control freak. Awesome. Managed to contact Henry or Danny? Just Henry so far. Dragged him out of rehab. Great story, actually. What the hell? Henry didn't know, 
Denny's been in Night City all this time. On his way over to see her now. Gonna be a surprise. We're all gonna meet over at Denny's. What, me too? Why? You're gonna play with us, aren't you? You're gonna meet the others. Send you the address. Oh, well, this could be interesting. Meeting the rest of the gang. Where's my car? Hello? There it is. To Denny's mansion. So, because Denny moved in to the orc tree thing as well, didn't he? Tell you what, they put a lot of work into the vehicles on this, like the physics and stuff. The other problem I do have with it is when you turn, for example, like this. I mean, if you turn left for some reason, it just snaps. It's like it's very, very responsive. See those? Oh, what happened here? She must have been renovating. Henry must have borrowed the truck. Gonk always was good at improvising. Maybe they're home. Try the intercom. Right then. Guess we keep looking. Okay. Are they going to be inside? Hello? You fucking god? Who oh boy? Oh god. Danny, what, Sounds sadly for What are you doing here? V. Uh This is really here. your house? We got a problem. This is your fucking pool? The hell is that? You're gonna pay for this, you This piece is supposed of shit. to be Henry's surprise. You bet I will. Yeah, I obviously so missed I a few back beats. Again. Looks like maybe then sort of you'll rush. tell me why the hell you so left me to die. So he flooded in the, the pool street. with concrete. <laughs> Henry Left's did often die. get emotional. Oh, I wish you, you know would what happened between die. them. From what I've come why to understand, one day then he disappeared without a get word. The fuck then out. hid from Henry. Imagine that wasn't too hard what, in his now? state of Already? mind. Either no out of it or in tour. rehab. Yep. That is, till I gave Henry her address. Go anywhere near them in your What day. about the concert? I haven't gotten a I chance to ask Denny yet. Doesn't look good, though. V, talk to them. Oh, Carrie will what? just make it worse. They don't know. Uh, not really my biz. Don't go, know go. what? They'll get past and I lost years of sand. my life to a Carrie didn't bag. piss all over himself out of joy when he saw yeah. me either. Fuck. <laughs> that how you remember it? This Getting myself involved in this bloody family feud. In case you forgot why the hell you came here in the first place? Good evening. Carrie sent me. It's about the concert. What concert? Why isn't he here talking to me? Look, it's awkward. Carrie considers you both friends. What a sensitive guy. Shit. Given he's the one who set this flaming turd bag on my doorstep. <laughs> we'll bring it back samurai. One night only. That's what he wants to get the crew together for? Sweet. But no fucking way. Not about to play with this shit stain. Danny. No. No way. Either him or me. Choose. Denny digs in her heels. We're done. How's it going? Like shit, man. Denny wants me out of the gig. And we already agreed on everything. What? Carrie's paying you? That's what this is about? Fuck. It's all fucking great. So you get him away from me and get the fuck off my lawn. Don't make me choose. Pretty sure it's your call. Fuck really pisses me off. Denny's on a control kick, setting conditions. On the other hand, Henry's got scop for brains. Can't trust him. Thanks. Real helpful. Maybe if someone would tell me what happened. Are you blind? Fucker filled my pool with cement. <laughs> Maybe he had a good reason. <laughs> really? 
A reason? Who's staring at it? You out of your fucking mind with the pool? <coughs> you knew Carrie wanted to get Danny to play with us. Just wanted to clear the air. Fucking Prem. You out of your oh. fucking mind with the pool? Did not mean to do that you again. You knew Carrie wanted to get Danny to play with us. Just wanted to clear the air. Fucking Prem. Got to go without one or the other. Uh, yeah, not a problem. Should be able to borrow someone else for one gig. Won't be the same, though. It won't ever be the same, Carrie. Well, uh, if we gotta choose, let's play with Danny. Fuck, Carrie! Seriously? She's the one making a big deal out of this, not me! Listen, I'll get you- You know what, Carrie? Fuck you! Good thing Silverhand isn't here to see this. You done? Get out. Well. All right, what about Nancy? We make contact. She's gonna set it all up and let us know. See you at the show. Fuck. Now I gotta find someone to clean this up. Okay, about all we can do for now. Except to wait for Nancy to call. We'll take that. Leave Denny's villa and wait for a day for Nancy to call. Noise! Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Should I just wait for the 24 hours? I guess we could, right? To get this whole story arc kind of complete. Yeah, I think we will. Let's just, let's, um, wait 24 hours. And wait for the call. <coughs> there she is. Oh, it's Jefferson. Hello, V. Uh, Jefferson? Listen, I need your help. Matters private. Sure. Okay. What's it about? Not on the hollow. Come by. I'll lay it out. Explain everything. Got your back, Jefferson. Not to worry. Great. We'll see you here then. Remember where? Of course. Be there in no time. So Jefferson is the guy with um, him and his wife did the mayor thing, right? We uh, we helped him out with that thing. I'm pretty sure like Denny meant to call. Maybe I was going to wait a little bit longer. Maybe. I'm just going to wait another 24 hours because this doesn't take long. How much cash have I got as well whilst I'm here? 46,000. No perk points. Let's have a quick look at the map and head to a auto fixer. Which is one right there. Let's see if I can be able to buy a car yet. Or the one I'm after. Because my street cred's gone up a little bit now. But let's go meet Judy. And see what she's got up her sleeve. Meet Judy on Cloud's Terrace in the early morning. Let's go and see Judy. And see what she has planned. For Evelyn's revenge, I guess. Okay, so... Wait, is this... This is not where I live, is it? I don't live here, do I? No, I live in building 8, right? Or building 10. One of them. Yeah, because I've got the sushi stand outside my apartment, haven't I? Actually... That's a good point. Where's Brendan? Wait, where's Brendan? They just came and took him just like that. They said they, said they had to reevaluate part of his code. <coughs> I tried stopping them, told them he was my best friend. They looked at me like I was crazy. If they just talked to him, they'd have realized Brendan isn't a typical schism. I knew a 
couldn't have just been me. He's like, a, he's like a real person. They took him to a maintenance point. One of them must have felt sorry for me or something. He gave me his card. Bring him back, please. I. Uh, they took I Brendan. Can't do this without him. Brendan is the man, the myth, the legend who fixed our bloody visual bug. We gotta go and save him. Provides 330% recommended daily values. Back to clouds. Dale. Anyway, you look. Fury! Carnage! <laughs> Follow your instincts! Yo, 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 my tubers, shroomers, and fumers. Mr. Whitey here. Drop that milk toast kibble and rush to the nearest store for a taste of sweet... Crazy buddy commercials. There's the big vegetable guy up there as well. I wonder what the city of the future is going to look like. Synthetic meat, you're in for a treat. Try ours today. Very she? Judy? I guess we're just waiting. Hey, V. Oh, hello. Thanks for showing. Talking with my ghost like a game of 3D chess. Don't let her derail you. Care to be a bit more specific? Wouldn't mind knowing what to expect. Expect everything. Miss a beat, she'll wrap you around her finger, get you on her agenda while thinking you're the one in control. Ooh. <laughs> Guess I know the type. Some deets about her could be useful when I talk to her, don't you think? No. Leave the talking to me. How do you aim to get her over to our side? By telling the truth. About Evelyn. What happened and why. Think that'll cut it? No. Have to improvise from there. You seem a bundle of nerves. I have a mind to kill the bastards with my bare hands. So yeah, you could say I'm a teensy bit nervous. I'm ready. Let's go. So who are we going to see? Hold on. I'll open it. Looks like you've come this way before. More than once. <laughs> I have, on occasion. Easy as paella. Paella. Follow me. Judy Alvarez. I'd say it's great to see you, but I've never been one to lie. Hello. Also, I never like surprise parties, but you know. Yup, bet I even know why. Thought you'd hit rock bottom when you joined the mocks. Guess you've managed to stoop even lower now. Consorting with a persona who is very non grata. Yes, V. I mean you. Uh. <laughs> Guess it left a lasting impression. Good. Paid you one <laughs> visit, and you remember me. My job, among other things, is to remember unsavory customers. Naturally, I take it upon myself to deal with them, too. Now, how am I to deal with you? 
Why don't I remember Michael? From clouds. So? Don't mind me. Just here to blend into the decor. That's no reason. Why come at all? To make sure Judy gets what she came for. Jude would have had a better chance without you. Judy has a proposal. About clouds. Wanna come back? Done. Always valued your skills, you know that. Just don't get why you had to drag this... loose end in here. Stop treating dolls like meat and I'll consider it. But first things first. Clouds needs to be taken from the Tiger Claws. Okay, look. It's clear what happened to Ev was... traumatic. Huh? I was convinced you didn't know. That girl was asking for an unhappy ending. I was just surprised it took so long. We gotta do something! Or everyone will end up like Evie! Woodman raped her while she was unconscious, then sold her like she was so much scrap. Yeesh, you've always been unstable. Okay, since you seem more reasonable, care to explain what this is about? Judy's idea. Think about it. It could work. Well, well, Jude. See, you found a true and loyal fan. You aware what Woodman did to Evelyn when she was desperate for help? You sit by, let that happen? Tiger Claw bosses rule this place. Know how much I mean to them? About as much as you two and your problems mean to me. Read negligible. Doesn't it make you wonder why you even work here? Gonna pretend as if you two weren't ever here. For old time's sake, Judy. Literally moments from now, security's gonna figure out you're here. Got two options. Go out the way you came in, or get thrown out. And that's not a threat or figure of speech. Just a friendly heads up. Had enough. I'm leaving. Smart move. And so you don't think I'm brushing you off completely? Forrest will be on the maintenance level in a couple minutes. Alone. You picked the wrong side, Maiko. I'll be the judge of that. I'm not your enemy here. And I didn't ask for your opinion. Hmm. That went smoothly. Swimmingly. She totally blew us off. Don't worry. She put on an act. A few days down the line, she'll call and tell you her plan to take over clouds as if it was her idea. You might be on to something. Awkward place to get into this, though. Why is it showing there's two people in that room now, even though I just left? You two have a history? Way back, yeah. I think I just felt lonely. Like everyone in Night City. She was different then. So was I. Can't trust people that see everything as a numbers game. <coughs> Line between patting you on the back as their friend and planning knifing you as their enemy is down to a decimal. I know. Right there with you, I... Well, used to have a big crush on her. It took me a long time to realize who she really was. But still, honest or crooked, we need her. Just think, could've gone diving this morning. A little unwinding do you good. Do me good too, actually. I wouldn't have been unwinding, not exactly. Got an idea buzzing in my head, working it, but I can't say if it'll amount to anything. Yeah, you, a deck chair and a Mai Tai with a cocktail umbrella. Somehow I don't see it. 
No. Me and the deck chairs, me mulling over coulda, shoulda, wouldas. Something I avoid right now. Coulda, shoulda, wouldas. Where are we going, Judy? One thing I've noticed is when, even though you can follow them, um, and it slows you down like this, when they go downstairs, you just go back to normal speed. We're going down. Wait a sec. What about Woodman? Don't have an ounce of sympathy for that motherfucker. He dies. So, we go in there? <clears throat> Damn straight. Let's end them. We'll take the elevator. Quickest way. Maintenance level. Time, Time to go and take out corpo. Woodman. A wannabe corpo bitch. You mean Maiko? Piece of work, that one. But I'll give her credit. She's dead on about Hello, your chances of I'm pulling Jeremy this Jordan off. I'm with N54 News, and this is your local latest. The NCPD has urged caution when using data terms. A routine inspection has shown many have been corrupted with malware. Police experts have confirmed the identified virus can lead to cyberware failure and, in extreme cases, even death. Fuck you two. This guy. Where's Maiko? Why'd you fucking call me here? When Evelyn needed help, you raped her. Could have also broken her neck. Hung up her head like a chandelier till it started to rot. <laughs> Instead, I took her to a ripper. Was due a little something in return. She should be grateful. And so should you. Hmm. <laughs> Here's my token of gratitude. Careful, they heard something. Let's, uh, let's get out of here, V. You dickhead. Commitment to eradicating the district's criminal presence. Today's final story is an unwelcome one. I I'd, uh, well, at least that dick's been uh, been killed. Punch the ground floor. Need to get out of this place. Thank you for tuning in to the N54. Almost felt like the world would be a better place once he died. I totally forgot it was him. That was Woodman, the guy that were who was in the office when I spoke to him. <clears throat> spoke to him ago. You know, revenge isn't ever really worth it. People want to believe it'll be the miracle pill for their grief. That's not how it works. Well, at least that guy's dealt with. I think the only thing we need to do now is just go and deal with Johnny. And then saying that when he's going back to Perez, that per Perezzi guy as well, him and his wife. You're right there. I gotta get back to Michael with something big. Appealing to her sense of justice wasn't big enough. Michael only works with specifics. A minute there. Thought you were about to call it quits. V. I go for days tuning virtues in a basement. Know what the chances are of somebody blowing my head off down there? Minuscule? Same as Michael's empathy. Unlike you, I don't put myself out there. But this ain't over. Not yet. You know, I'm also partial to specifics. Uh-huh. So that's what matters. How many you'll drop. How much ammo you'll use. How many eddies it'll get you. Art and dreams of freedom can't be everyone's food. 
Sometimes, you gotta deal with the dirt. So, what now? Gotta think. We need more bodies, that's for sure. I'm gonna talk to the dolls. Is Judy gonna take over, like, clouds? I'll and... call you when I've got something. See you later, V. And thanks. <laughs>